In this video, I'll be helping you with a math problem type called writing integers as rational numbers, as seen here in the OpenStax College Algebra 2nd Edition text. Before starting this example, we should start with a description of what integers are. To work our way up to integers, we would start with natural numbers or counting numbers. So those would be our numbers like 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. Again, these are natural numbers. If we include zero, we would have the list of all the whole numbers. And when we include the opposites of these numbers, so our negatives, this set makes up all of the integers. And then for rational numbers, those are numbers that can be written in fractional form, m over n, where both m and n are integers, of course, n cannot be equal to zero. And since we're asked here to write each one of these as a rational number, starting with seven, we can write seven as a fraction where our numerator and denominator are integers. And the easiest one would just be to write a seven in the numerator and a one in the denominator. Although there are certainly other ways to write seven as an integer over an integer such as 14 over 2, and so on. But since we were just asked for 1, we can go with the easiest 7 over 1. For b, we're asked to write 0 as rational. So here my fraction can be written with a 0, and again just a 1 in the denominator. For c, we have a negative number, negative 8. But here as well, negative 8 is an integer. And if we write negative 8 as negative 8 over 1, now we can see that we've written it as a fraction with integers in the numerator and denominator. 